Are you ready to take another uh, joyful journey? The latest labs, it is the tape piano. So this is the labs page. And one thing I encourage you guys to do is subscribe to the new labs channel. So I feel like the weatherman, there's a high pressure system coming in from the, uh, from the West. So, but uh, check out the new labs YouTube channel. They're running a really cool scavenger hunt uh, uh, contest on there. And it's very interesting to see what they're doing with labs. The newest labs piano is the tape piano and it's an upright uh, and they've processed it with the uh, vintage tapes and that kind of thing. And so we're just gonna just start off and have some fun. Okay, so I'm gonna pull this up here. You know, a totally free instrument. You do need to um, use the Spitfire downloader in order to pull these down. And the Spitfire downloader actually has its own dedicated labs. I guess it's called a tab. Let's just take a quick look and I'll show you how to get the labs instruments real quick. So this is all of your products that, that you've previous purchased from Spitfire or Spitfire has been gracious to provide these libraries for me. And I just so appreciate it because I can share them with you. But if you look next to my products, you'll see labs. And when you click on that, these are all the labs instruments that are available. Boy, there is a there are tons. It started with the uh, soft piano and strings. Uh, this free soft piano started a pretty much a revolution here, uh, but we can go on and we can see all of these amazing instruments. And if you have not installed them, you'll see a little install uh, button there. That's how you would get that. And then uh, just to make sure uh, your settings here, you can set, uh, set up your default content path. So that's where you want to store all the libraries, uh, your VST2 and VST3 location here. And so if you do that, if you get those things kind of set up, then you'll be good to go. Let's uh, just dive in to the tape piano. Let's just uh, pull up the first preset capstan upright. I think that's what I was playing at the beginning. It's just got an unusual tone to it. It's uh, just that lo-fi vibe happening there. Really nice. Okay, and I'm gonna just skip my levels, making sure my levels are good and that I'm hearing everything without uh, clipping and all that nice stuff. Yeah, that's better. And we've got the controls here, the stability control. Let's just move that a little bit. And that just throws it into some different tape loops and different uh, effects processing. It's just got a neat, uh, I guess a neat vibe to it. So, and then we've got a reverb setting. We can crank the reverb up. And then we've got different uh, convolution reverbs here. Uh, and right here it's uh, evolution that's uh, selected. extreme but that's kind of cool they give us kind of like a convolution reverb that gives us a really neat uh, neat effect when you listen to that kind of go and then uh, we've got a noise floor that we can it's just got all kinds of equipment noise just to make it more lo-fi <laughs> Lo-fi, lo-fi, and uh, it's good to see BF. Uh, BF is in the house, and it's always a pleasure to see you. Um, okay, so we've got felt cassette. Yeah, they process these through different tape machines and even like a magnetic card reader. I've uh, I've seen Heinbach use these these old magnetic card readers to record and resample these sounds. It seems like with each new labs instrument, they just they just keep getting better and better. It's amazing. 
amazing, free. This is a free piano and it's really cool. I'm gonna crank the stability all the way over and see what we've got. Yeah, it detunes and warbles. That's a lot of fun. So let's just check out uh, the magnetic reader. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. Uh, and you're talking about, that's as low fi as you can get. That's crazy. Okay, now, and then we can still crank the stability up and get even crazier. Yeah, I used to shake the record player. Sometimes uh, you'd shake the record player, at, at, you know, and get things kind of warbly. And you hear the, uh, you hear the noise. Yeah, you hear the you hear the crazy noise uh, noise floor and stuff going on. Um, okay, spliced up right. That's amazing. Yeah, it's just got its own unique character. Really cool. And one more here, tape head. Now this is more clean. So you've got like a standard version and a felted. So you've got... And, and what I did when I first um, when I first started playing around with the uh, with this piano, um, I went ahead and just um, did some. Let's see, da, 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 da. I did some experiments with this. Um, I went ahead and added a couple of more uh, Labs instruments. So I added the um, the Labs drum kit, which is got some really nice. You got some flams. So that's kind of cool. And then I went ahead and did, uh, pulled up the lab's bass and just kind of laid down. It's, it sounds like a pick. Okay, and then what I did, I just kind of laid down a little groove with the drums and let's just see what happens. So I'm gonna pull the, uh, the Labs piano back in here. And uh, yeah, the drums are free too. Yeah, all of these Labs instruments are free and it's an absolutely wonderful resource. Um, so here is the Labs uh, tape piano and let's just, uh, let's just see what, what happens here. And the GUIs are resizable and having all kinds of fun with that. Okay, that's the drums and the bass, and here is the piano. Here we go. Let's see what happens here. Yeah.
nice little clean group. So it can just take you, um, take you on a lot of joyful journeys, uh, <laughs> and because it's the it's the feel, it's the it's the vibe. I guess I keep using that word vibe because you can feel that uh, coming coming from the piano. And and you know the thing is about sampling is that you're just not recording an instrument. You're recording you're recording so much more than that. You're recording. Um, emotions and tones and textures and feelings and you know and then the person that is actually playing the original samples you you're taking part in that too and it's a uh, just a really mysterious and wonderful thing when you think about all that happens when when you press a key on a sampled uh, instrument so the links are gonna be in the description so make sure you check out the uh, labs tape piano and it is just another another win, I think, for the labs team and for Spitfire for just giving us all of these amazing instruments. So just a nice little clean group.